Hey guys, it's Leia. Today we will learn how to compute derivatives using the constant rule. Let's first go over what a derivative is. The derivative is the slope of a function. You can determine the slope of a function at any point by taking the derivative. Let's see an image of this to better understand. We have a graph in our function f of x. We wish to find the slope at x. So we take another point, x plus h, where h is close to zero, and we take the slope of those two points. The slope is equal to the change of y over the change of x, which can be written as dy over dx, and this equals to the limit as h approaches zero of f of x plus h minus f of x over h. Now let's talk about the constant rule. It's a very simple rule that will be really easy to remember. The rule states that the derivative of any constant is zero. Let's see a graph to understand. We have the graph of f of x, which is equal to c, a constant. The slope of this function at any point is zero because the function is not increasing or decreasing, it's staying constant. Let's see an example. We want to compute the derivative of 55. The rule says that the derivative of any constant is zero. Since 55 is a constant, the derivative is zero, which is our answer. Next example, we want to compute the derivative of the square root of 18. Since the square root of 18 is a constant, the derivative is zero, which is our answer. Last example, we want to compute the derivative of sine of pi over 2. We know that sine of pi over 2 equals 1. And since 1 is a constant, the derivative is 0. Hopefully you found that pretty simple. However, if you need more help or want practice on this topic, visit www.symbolab.com and click on the practice tab.